Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to another episode of the experience, the human experience challenge. For a minute I couldn't remember what I was doing. And we've come back pretty much straight after Amara finished work last time. It was her first day on the job and she had a pretty rubbish day. Um, we've come home to find random lady in the house. She knows Amara. Oh, is there a... I don't think there was a meetup going on. No, that's Caleb. Amara. No, but she's not an alien. I don't know who she is, but she's in the house using the computer. I don't know. I don't recall her being in there. But Amara knows her. Not sure how, though. Um... Maybe it's a work friend? No, not work. Friends? Well, she's not... Oh! Honest, honestly, I have no idea how Amara knows this woman. <laughs> but she's in the house using the computer. Okay, so, yeah. Strange lady. That's fine, because we need friends. One of Amara's missions is to get friends... Um, have five good friends, I think it is. So, uh, what's her name? Selma? Selma. Selma can be one of her friends. So, um, yeah, so last week we had Amara's first day on the new, uh, her new job as a cadet in the police force, and it was so so. It was pretty rubbish as first days go. Caleb, please go and look after your child. He's not happy. And um, other than that, no, not Amara, Caleb. Other than that, there isn't much going on. I've changed the outside of the house because I've been on a bit of a building spree. I, I don't know. All of a sudden, I really like building houses. So I changed the outside. I made the walls taller. I want to see if that made any difference. And I changed the roof because I had done what I had done with the roof. It was a bit weird. And lots of little roofs. So I've changed it to this is a bit weird. I might put actually I might put some windows in there. Like portholes. Um, can I do that? I don't know. We want little windows. Um, don't they have little round ones? Although round is not really going to fit. We need little... Like that. I don't know if that's going to... Uh, no, it's just clicking to a grid. I don't know. I'll have to have a think about it. Um... But yeah, I changed up the outside, I made some of the plants smaller, pushed them up against the house so it looked better. I made these trees smaller as well, because I didn't I didn't like how they were when they were bigger, and actually I want to make that tree smaller. Not that small. That's it. Because some of the trees are quite big and stuff, and I didn't really like that. So I just made a few changes to the outside, move some of the plants around, and yeah, so there's that. Bring the walls down, it might help. So, Caleb, what? No, Micah, did you look after Micah? No. Caleb, did you look after Micah? You did. Elise is cleaning the shower, which is good. And there's not much going on at the moment, so let's fast forward a little bit. And we need to get... Oh, what's wrong with Micah now? Okay, well you got... That's the one thing that bugs me. Sims don't autonomously go and look after their children. Yes, they'll go and talk to them, or shush them, or whatever. Are you going to change his diaper? No. See, he's not... He's not going to change his diaper. He's just talking to him and trying to get him to be quiet. It's like, why Sims can't just autonomously, autonomously go to the baby and work out what's wrong with them and do it? I don't know. 
because that is a real pain. Right, Caleb, you can clean that bath too, because it's nasty. So, yeah, we got to get Amara working on her skills, her gardening skills. It's autumn. There's not much that's going to grow. And how many friends does she have? Relationships. Okay, we've got Alicia, Don. Oh, no, that's the wrong person. Outside of her household, it's just Selma. We need to work on those relationships. So we'll probably have a few more. Because Luna, it was Luna and... Hmm. We need to make a friendship club. Yeah, Luna and Jess, they've gone down from um, Strangerville. There was somebody else beginning with L. Leslie. Yeah, we need to make a friend club. Clubs. She's part of Aliens Anonymous. We need to make a new one. Um, let's just make a club. And you can tell I've been watching too many, you know, My Little Pony and all that kind of stuff. Friends forever. Because you can only have one BFF, apparently. Add admission rule. Um, there's no admission rules. Can it just be open to anybody? Okay, let's see. She works with Luna. We can have her. Um, should we just t pick the first five people on her friend list? Well, Sal well, Salma's there. We know Salma. Oh, she works with Leslie and Luna. Okay. Well, that's cool. And um, Candy, because I like her hair. That's one, two, three, four, and let's pick a guy because we need another. Oh, and Eva, because she kind of knows Eva from work. You need a description. A can't spell. For Amara. We need an icon, because you always need an icon for groups. Um, rainbows, because, you know, rainbows and stuff. And what should we do? I th um, cooking is always good. If you get everybody to come and cook, then you just get loads of food in your fridge. Cook. Um, art and music. Dance, just simple stuff. Watch TV. Where was Watch TV? Watch TV is one as another one. Watch TV would be under. I don't know. Watch movies. Should we pick another one? Let's pick another one. Uh, fun and games? No. Social. Be friendly. That works. Okay, Amara, you need to go and use the toilet before you burst. And it's only two in the morning, so we can't do anything. Um... Micah's birthday isn't until Saturday. Although we might age him up before then because there's no specific thing. So there's no reason why we can't age him up today. I think we'll do that. We'll age him up today. Uh, eggs and toast. Put that away. So as soon as it's... What time do you go to work? Starts in six hours. So you start at eight. Eight till five. So when you come home from work... We will age up um, Micah. Actually, we can do it before because we don't need a party or anything. You just need to click on the on the thing. 
Oh my... Amara, seriously? You were literally within spitting distance of the toilet. Oh my god. You were within spitting distance of the toilet. You could, you could have aimed at the toilet from where you were standing. Come on. Uh, never mind. Right, there should be food in the fridge. Uh, Don came home. Don, you need to, you. Seriously, we need to get you another job because you're rubbish at this. You are really rubbish at your job. Because his performance is excellent, he should get a. Perf he should get something. Oh, we'll leave him. Oh, and Don got abducted last time, didn't he? But I'm not seeing. I'm not seeing any little alien buns in the oven, so he's good. All right, Don, come and do something. Play with your phone. I can't believe Amara did that. Entertainment. Play a game. Play a game. So, yeah, so next time Micah wakes up, we'll age him up. Now, is who wanted Amara's is her aspiration, big happy family. Okay, so we can we can buy lots of toddler stuff as well. Well, let's do that in preparation then. We have a potty. I don't know, I've been on a real um, building and decorating spree. Downloaded. I've been downloading loads of CC custom content. I don't know why. I never used to like it and then all of a sudden it's like, yeah, best thing ever. Um, we want a bed. I wish you could pull this tab up so that, you know, you can see stuff. See more stuff. What colour? I think purple. You like dinosaurs. Let's put that on. Let's put on some bedding. Do we have purple bedding? That could work. And we want a bin. What else do we want? Do we want a nightstand? I think we do. What purple options do we have? No nightstand. We want a bookcase though. Even though we've already got a bookcase in the house, but kids' bookcases are always good. Let's put you there. Have we got our thousand dollars yet? Thousand simoleons? No, we still need another five hundred. Six hundred simoleons. Okay, what else? We need lots of um, toys and so on. So, stacking blocks. The dollhouse is a good thing. And that's kind of big, so we can size it down by using the square bracket. The square bracket size things up and down. Um, what are the colours? There's that. There's that. Yeah, I prefer that one. Okay, um, what else? That is a dollhouse, isn't it? That's a tree house. I think that is some type of dollhouse. And you got this dollhouse, which again, we can size down. The footprint is really big though. I think if I size it down, the animations might look a bit strange, but it's still it's still usable. Because I've never tried downsizing the dollhouse, but I know you could do it. I've seen other people do it as well. Uh, what else can we get? Oh, we want the the rab the wabbit tablet. Do 
Don't you get this in different colours? And there's a way to cycle through the colours. And I see you're holding onto it and use the plus key. There you go. But it only works when you first pick it up. It doesn't work when you've already placed it and then you pick it up again. If I use the plus key, then the camera moves. So yeah, that only works when you first pick it up out of the um, your inventory. Inventory out of the build bike mode. And we should probably get him a toy chest as well. Can we size that down? Oh, we can. Oh, that is so cute. I prefer that size to the other size. Yeah. So we have a bookcase. We've got a doll's house. We've got the tree house. Which I wanted to be closer to the wall. There. If you hold down Alt, it would help move it, like not snapping to a grid. And I also use the BB, was it BB dot move I move objects, and that will place objects where they don't usually go. So that helps. And also, let's move you across slightly. Yep. And the other thing I wanted was the teddy bear. And where are you? Not that one. The big one that they hug. Except we're going for the dinosaur. And size you down a little bit as well. There. So that's it. That should be. Yep, cool. So she needs two. What else? Re read to a child for two hours. Socialize with your child ten times. Okay, that's easy. So, Amara, you're just very embarrassed because you wet yourself. You didn't... <sighs> uh, I don't know. I'm going to blame your alien physiology. That's what it is. Um, enable aura. Frame the canvas. And name it. What should we call it? Um... Enigmatic dreams. Yeah, I think that's perfect. I don't know. Recently, I've just been kind of like, I've just really, really, really gotten into The Sims. I mean, not that I wasn't into it. If I wasn't into it, I wouldn't be recording videos. But um, no, I've just like found a new found love for it. And The Sims 4, even though this this is the game that I've been able to play the most because I haven't needed a lot of mods or cost custom content in order for it to play. Because with The Sims 2 and... The Sims 2, yeah, I think for me The Sims 2 is always, always like the perfect one. And then The Sims 4 is like, yeah, I can play it, I don't need mods. Sims 3... I loved the open world, but in order for it to work properly and have story progression and stuff, I've always needed mods to go in it. So Sims Sims 4 has been the one game I've been able to play unmodded for a very long time. But recently I've just found a really... I've really gotten into it and I've really kind of like, yeah, I really like this game now. It's only, what, four years after it's come out? Or three years? How long has it been out? I can't remember. But yeah, it's you know only a couple of years after it came out, but I really I really like it now. Amara, what are you doing? You went for food. You don't want food. Yeah, cheer her up, Caleb. She really needs cheering up. But the two of them are still in love. They haven't really fallen out of a friendship range or anything. Okay, who's stinky? Is it Alicia? Could be Alicia. No, it's not Alicia. The only person who was stinky is um Don, and he's in the he's in the bathroom. Okay, Micah's awake. No, you don't age him up. Uh, 
Alicia, you can age him up. Age up. Let's get a good view. Wow, you have a lot of hair. Alright, let's have a quick pause and have a look. Uh, tab. Yeah, he has a lot of hair. Not sure who he takes after. But I think we'll have that as a screenshot. But yeah, I'm not sure who he takes after. But he has a lot of hair. Okay. Well, Alicia, you can make yourself useful. And potty train him. Because once he's potty trained, then he can use the potty by himself. So you can use the potty by yourself. Your parents were chat. Oh, where's... Oh, good God, woman. I thought she just wet herself. Why has she been eating or drinking that she needs to go to the bathroom constantly? Okay, well... And Micah is not an alien. I don't even think he's... Oh, he's a vampire. He's a vampire. Look at his look at the thing over his knees. It's a little vampire thing. Okay. So we have another vampire. All right, you can repair that. He's a vampire. Ooh. And actually, I now I really Your want boy. Micah, not Micah, <laughs> Caleb Broken. and Amara to have another child because I want to see if they'll have another vampire or if they have an alien or if they'll have a human. I don't know. Oh, that's what that noise was. I thought it was something in my house. <laughs> I didn't realise it was the laptop. Okay, but yeah, I really want them to have... Oh look, because he's, he's got the ears too. He's got pointed ears. He's a vampire. Okay. But I don't think he'll actually come into his powers until he is a teen. Alright, potty train Micah. Where are you off to? Hopefully not to work. Oh no, you've got eight hours. You're fine. Because, yeah, like I said, once he's potty trained, he can um, he can go to the potty himself. He just needs to get to potty. His skill level needs to get up to two. And then he can go by himself. We don't have to worry about that. And also, I've discovered that if you... All right, let's join Amara. If you um, leave out food for toddlers they will get a plate for themselves. You don't need a high chair because I always used to go through the whole putting them in a high chair and then one of the sims would forget them and then they'd be in the high chair and throw in a tantrum because nobody wanted to pick them up. But like I said, I've discovered that you don't need to do that. As long as there's food out, they can grab a plate, which does make life a whole lot easier because I really didn't like high chairs. Okay, two. Training day two, train harder. Um, okay. Go on patrol. All right, you, you're so, have you, oh, she's got a bladder infection from, it's from the slice of life mod. So that's why she keeps going. Okay, well, go on patrol. While 
When an officer is on patrol, they can get to know the, com the community and help keep troublemakers in check. Talk with residents to make a friendly or mean impression. If you see anyone littering or fighting, issue a citation to make sure they obey the law. Okay, clue discovered. There's clues? Amara has discovered the suspect is a young adult. Amara has discovered the suspect hates children. Amara has discovered the suspect has black hair. All right, I didn't even realize we were supposed to be looking for a suspect. Um, so why have you come into somebody's house? We can't go into the... We can't go into their houses, so why are you here? Um, go there. That's a bit random. That was very random. So issue a citation for littering or fighting. Well, go use the bathroom, quick. While there's nobody around. Because there is literally nobody around. I mean, you have picked the, the nice part of town, I guess? It's not a rough neighborhood. And chat with civilians. Okay. Who are you chatting to? Whoever he is. He, she. And friendly introduction. You weren't who he you he was going to chat with. You were going to chat with. Why is everybody angry? Okay, we've seen nobody fighting or anything else. So, so. Listen like Kumba. Hard dude, skin for plush. Alright, there's someone there. We're gonna have to zoom out to see if we see anybody, but not really. Oh, this is annoying. Okay, uh, friendly introduction. Are we going to... I think this is the problem that I had with this career when I first played it way back. When the pack, when Get to Work first came out. I couldn't find anybody who was fighting or anything you'd have to issue a citation to. Sorry I keep zooming in and out, but it's just to try and find people doing stuff. Because you can't, you can't see anybody. We've got a living statue. Um, friendly, what's your name? Oh, Elias. So yeah, we could be here all day. And I'm not sure we'd actually see anybody fighting. Elias, you're one scary dude. Uh -huh. I haven't seen anybody dropping any litter either. Maybe we should return to the station and go on patrol again, see if we get a different neighbourhood. Yeah, Amara, you... Yeah. Uh, go to police station. Okay, Elias does not want to talk to you. Uh, Emane doesn't want to talk to you either. Goodbye. Yeah. I'm not quite sure what happened. But I seem to remember this is the problem I had. I couldn't find people who were fighting or anything like that. You have processed enough clues to issue a all points bulletin? What? When you have a rough description of the suspect, 
the more clues you find in process, the more specific the description becomes. When you have a very detailed description of the perp, you'll be less likely to arrest an innocent who shares a few similarities with the guilty party. Okay. Um, this is looking kind of bugged. Because we haven't done anything to... Um, all right, what does it say about the black hair, hates children, and a young adult? Suspect is wearing a tank top. This is... I don't know. Let's go back on patrol and see where it sends us. Because if it's going to be glitchy, I don't know, I'll have to do a bit of research. And now we're someplace else. And again, we have to wait, what, five sim minutes for somebody to turn up? I don't even know where we are. This looks like it's um Oasis. Is it Oasis? Oh, who's he? I'm assuming that's a he. Oh, it's Eric from the science lab. Well, none of these are a young adult with a tank top. I feel a bit lost here. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what? Um, more choices. Friendly introduction. Can we give him a citation? Um, oh, issue citation. I just saw it. Issue citation. There you go. Because. Alright, well, let's go back to the police station, I guess. I don't know. I'm not sure whether to try and stick this career out or just to stick, switch to another one. Okay, go use the toilet and then we'll try issue an APB. Because we know the suspect is in a tank top, has black hair, hates children, is a young adult. That's quite specific. Although that could be half of half of Sim Nation, I don't know. But if it keeps jumping around like that, I think we might just try a different career. And possibly one that doesn't involve us having to go into work. Uh issue an APB. Um Okay, a suspect fitting the APB description has been spotted in this area. Ask around to see if anyone can point you towards the suspect. Use a notebook to review the suspect description before you make an arrest. If you arrest the wrong person, it won't look good. Okay, um, yeah, just go there. Uh, no, don't want you. Let's have a look in your notebook. Tank top, young adult, hate children, has black hair, which we knew. 
and again there's nobody around is this oh this is a gym so I might as well go in out of the rain um, ask about suspect more choices friendly friendly introduction what uh, where are you going oh okay oh well there's oh there's no way to go directly from oh my god well that's a pain Um, a while ago over there. I think it might be you though. Um, friendly introduction. Um, oh, friendly. Analyze personality. You know, being an alien has its advantages. Because if he hates children, oh, <laughs> yeah, it's you. Arrest. It better be him, though. <laughs> Although that was kind of cheating, though. She's supposed to be hiding. She's an alien. I just remembered that after I made her do it. <laughs> Okay, now I'm at work out. Run criminals through the booking station, take crime reports from civilians, get to know your crime workers. Okay. Um, we have three hours. Talk to the chief. Who's the chief? Are you the chief? No, the chief is here. Detective. Talk to the chief. Um, where are we? Here we are. Okay, we managed to work out what's going on. She's talked to the chief. Give me the thing, achievement. Um, I think we might stick with this just for a little bit longer. Right, you're talking to the chief. Browse police database. Why did you not? Uh, discuss work. Uh, case theory. No. Although I think you could discuss case theories with the chief, right? Yeah. Yeah, this career seems to be a bit bugged. Okay. I think we're going to be looking for a new job. But we might leave it till... Right, where is the... Um, take mugshot. What? Can you not get there? Or go here? Can you go there? But that. <laughs> Take mugshot. Okay, no, he doesn't want me to take a mugshot of him. Or we'll take a mugshot of this woman, Anaya. No? Oh dear. Take mugshot. Uh, Hakim? Can you take a mugshot of Hakim? Okay, we got Hakim with his man bun.
Um, let's move forward a little bit. Oh god, really? That is annoying. Yeah, Amara, you go, you, um, go use the toilet and then go and sleep because you, you deserve it. And Don, you need to go and see what's wrong with, um, Micah. Actually, let's go and see what's wrong with Micah. He wants fun and he wants to use a toilet. Oh, no, she's just, he's just used the toilet. He's got a stinky nappy. But we need some food. But yeah, that was... That career seems to be bugged. Because that was all over the place. I don't think that's how it's supposed to be. Uh, eggs and toast. Put that there. Right, you're on the potty. And then you can grab a serving. Yeah, it's good practice for you, Don. But yeah, I think we're going to be looking for a new job for Amara. But I don't know what she'd want to do. Hmm. I don't know what she'd want to do. Because we could wait for, we could wait for the new um, Iron and Life pack to come out, which I'm very excited for because, you know, beaches and, you know, being able to, uh, too many dishes. Um, overload, leave dishes unwashed. Yeah, because if you overload the dishwasher, it's going to break. But yeah, Island... I did tell you go get some food. Stop crying. Yeah, I th I think we're going. We, yeah, so I was saying we could get we could wait for Island Life, which comes out next week, Friday, which is the day before um I record this episode. I record the next episode, or we could get her to do a freelance thing. I think we could just get her painting. To get to bring money in until Island Life comes out, because I think there's a I forget what it is. There is a new career in that conservationist, maybe. I think that's what it is. I might be wrong. Um, somebody called and said I heard Amara had gotten had been had become friends with somebody. No, that's Micah. Amara. Okay, all of a sudden she's got loads of friends. I'm not quite sure what's going on, but she now has loads of friends. That works for me. <laughs> I don't know. My game is imploding or something. But Amara, I don't think the corporate life is for you. I think we're just going to stay home and tend our trees, paint paintings and get money coming in that way. Because going off to work isn't really working. Um, okay, it's eight o'clock. And you're sad because you want some fun. Okay, come and come and watch some toddler videos. And these should have been thrown away. Sorry, I'm just trying. To, I just realised how obzocky this layout is. It's a real pain when you're trying to get the camera around it. But, nope. 
There you go. Put that back in the fridge. Put that in the fridge. But yeah, I think uh, his fun's going up. Good, good. And you... Oh. You need to feed. No, not potty train. No, 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 no. Clean it. But yeah, I keep getting distracted. But I think we are going to get Amara to stay at home. I think. I don't think having a career is the best thing for her. So until, at least we'll wait till Island Life comes out and see if there's anything in there worth taking. But at the moment, I think the best thing for her to do is to paint paintings, write some books, um, and look after Micah. I think that's the best thing. And then also, we can also work on her having another child and see if we get an alien baby, because that would be pretty cool. Because we have... We have a, a vampire. Let's see if we can get an alien or a human. So that's going to be it for this lesson. We're going to leave little angelic Micah with his shock of black hair. Is it black or brown? I can't tell. But with his shock of hair on his tablet, talking about ladybirds. And thanks very much for watching. I hope you like this week's episode. It has been a blast. And um, please like, comment and subscribe. It really helps my channel. And I will see you in next week's episode. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.